Thank you for joining Wars of the Roses. And this is Jones, Stephen from the Encyclopedia Freemasonry by Albert G. Mackey. Jones, Stephen, a miscellaneous writer and Masonic author of some celebrity. He was born at London in 1764 and educated at St. Paul's School. He was on leaving school placed under an eminent sculptor, but on account of some difference was removed and apprenticed to a printer. On the expiration of his articles, he was engaged as corrector of the press by Mr. Strahan, the King's printer. Four years afterward, he removed to the office of Mr. Thomas Wright, where he remained until 1797, when the death of his employer dissolved his immediate connection with the printing business. He then became the editor of the Whitehall Evening Post, and on the decline of that paper of the General Evening Post, and afterward of the European magazine. His contributions to literature were very various. He supervised an edition of Reed's Biographia Dramatica, an abridgment of Burke's reflections on the French Revolution, and also abridgments of many other popular works. But he is best known in general literature by his pronouncing an explanatory dictionary of the English language, published in 1798. This production, although following Walker's far superior work, was very favorably received by the public. In masonry, Stephen Jones occupied a very high position. He was a past master of the Lodge of Antiquity, of which William Preston was a member, and of whom Jones was an intimate friend and one of his executors. Preston had thoroughly instructed him in his system, and after the death of that distinguished mason, he was the first to fill the appointment of Prestonian lecturer. In 1797, he published Masonic Miscellanies in prose and poetry, which went through many editions, the last being that of 1811. In a graceful dedication to Preston, he acknowledges his indebtedness to him for any insight that he may have acquired into the nature and design of masonry. In 1816, he contributed the article Masonry or Freemasonry to the Encyclopedia Londinensis. In 1821, after the death of Preston, he published an edition of the illustrations with additions and corrections. Brumber Matthew Cook, London Freemasons Magazine, September 1859, says of him, in the Masonic craft, Brother Jones was very deeply versed. He was a man of genial sympathies and a great promoter of social gatherings. John Britton, the architect who knew him well, says of him, autobiography, page 302, that he was a man of mild disposition, strict honesty, great industry, and unblemished character. In his latter days, he was in embarrassed circumstances and derived pecuniary aid from the literary fund. He died on December 20th, 1828, of Dropsy in King Street, Holborn, London. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to share, like, subscribe and comment. And if you can, please consider donating to Wars of the Roses. Links to PayPal and Patreon are in the description. Thank you so very much.